um your girl is back with a, another torrid haul it's been a bit it has been a bit i told you i placed an order oh well by the time y'all are seeing this it's probably been about a month ago but the way they shipped everything was kind of different it was like hey this is ready we'll ship it hey this is ready we'll ship it and i was like dude are you kidding me anyways i have everything from torrid and the shoes that i or the boots that i've been talking about from belk b-e-l-k i know your girl has an accent i'm gonna be showing you the boots as well in today's haul i actually just finished doing a yvette sportswear haul because you all know that is like my favorite active wear that i wear when I'm using my peloton doing the pilates or what have you so there will be a video coming up i think it'll be probably the next video that you all see so if you all happen to watch that thank you they have a huge black friday sale that is going to be starting very very soon so don't miss out on that and of course i'll have these pieces linked below for y'all if y'all are interested in shopping a little event sportswear anyways if you are new here hello and welcome to the queen of rambles where she makes her intros crazy long talking third person is so weird anyways my name is Rhonda and over here we are all about embracing our curves embracing what the good lord gave us and uh, we don't let the number on the scale the tag in our which is to find our happiness you know why we are over we are over over it there's no reason for it all right love the skin we're in so um is it easy no are there days that we struggle yes but we are in this together friends so stick around all right let's go ahead and jump in to the first item so this is it's not what i thought it was <laughs> all right so uh when it comes to torrid i'm typically a 12 up top 14 on the bottom so i will have my measurements down below for you all this is a size one top that i went with because i will tell you all it is like their uh, cami type of material. And I had purchased some of their camis in a zero and it is just way too tight. So when I say I'm a 12 up top, it's more or less for their t-shirts. When it comes to their camis, their camis suck me into like a whole other dimension of I can't take it. So you'll probably find them on Poshmark when I finally get around to cleaning out that closet. So it's in a really pretty red and it has like this crisscrossy type of dealio going on. And I just thought it was too darn cute. I want to say this was in the clearance section maybe and then it does have a crisscross in the back but it is really cute and i will say like i haven't had an issue with their camis not holding up they definitely hold up all right y'all ready for this so they had them on sale and my gosh this feels like butter so i always talk about the bombshell skinny jeans now the retail value of these y'all is 85 dollars 50 because they were on sale and i think i had toward cash I probably had Torrid cash because, I mean, I don't ever buy anything at Torrid at full price. It's like fashion to figure. Just wait for a sale. So, I got these for 30 some dollars. I did get them in a size 14 and I have a pair in a size 12. But I, I, I'm just not about going through a workout when I put my, my jeans on. <laughs> So I did get them in a 14. I haven't tried anything on yet, but the nice thing about the bombshell skinny jeans is it just puts you together in all the right places. It lifts up the booty and it's just, they're so comfortable. I wish we had feel a vision so y'all could feel how soft, how wonderfully soft their jeans are because nobody likes like real denim, do they? I don't. I like cozy. I could have sworn I picked up two of the Ross. I'll have to check my receipt. I swear I thought I did. Okay, so my favorite, favorite bras. I, I still don't have one that is a, a favorite strapless uh, wire underwire free bra, but these are wire free bras. And these are the push-up bras. I get a 38D in them. And do you see this little crisscross? It's like the bombshell without all the fake padding kind of bra. I absolutely love, love, love these bras. I have it in a nude shade. And then I have the regular bras that don't have the crisscross that aren't push-up that have zero underwire. And I absolutely love them. They're so flipping comfortable and they stay in place. They're beautiful. Oh, this material feels so lovely. So I thought this was a it's a classic fit okay i screwed up so when it is a slim fit t-shirt i always size up to a one uh other than that if it's a classic fit i normally do a zero but i did not read because phew, hooked on phonics not for me 
So this is probably going to be a little baggy, but if I'm tucking it in, I absolutely love this tie-dye. It says, life updates, <laughs> still a mess. <laughs> yes. Oh, well, you know how I was feeling that day. Oh, okay, yay. I needed a cami so bad. I love these little crisscross details. I just think they're so pretty, especially with a cardigan. I went with a size one, and you see, like, it's kind of got that, like, spandexy type of material, and it just, like I said, the zero hugged me way too much and made me uncomfortable. So I absolutely love, love, love their camis. They had them on sale. Regular price was $22.50. I did not pay that. So that's why I never give you all the prices is because I never pay full price, like, ever for anything, like, at all. I sized up in a pair of their leggings because I could not handle the size that I had shown you all in the past. It was a size one. These are like their faux leather leggings. And, oh, I just got lipstick on there. They have a little bit of a funny smell to be honest with y'all. Oh, you know what, it's, it's <laughs> freaking bad. Uh, what I did do with a pair that I picked up from Shein is I pulled them inside out and I ran them through the wash like two or three times and then hung dry them and the smell went away. So I don't know what'll happen if I sweat in them after I've washed them and all of that. But yeah, they, they, they freaking smell potent. But anywho, this is kind of like that whole Spanx look. Now the ones I have, like I was telling y'all, is in a one. So around the waist it made me feel so uncomfortable. Uh, so I went ahead and I purchased them in a two. I don't remember them smelling like this. I wonder if they changed the material or something. But anywho, I thought these are always cute, kind of like a staple in my opinion for the whole fall and winter. Okay, so the cami is in a size one. I love the way it fits. The other thing, it reminded me that the zero come, oh, I got a boo-boo. I burnt myself last night, sorry y'all. But the zero comes up and gives me armpit wedgies on top of like all that sucking in. So perfect size one. As far as the pants go, I think they're really, really cute. I definitely like the way the two fits versus the one. You will see there's a little bit of, you know, it's a little loose on me, but the smell is really bugging me. Like, I do not remember the ones I got last year smelling like this. This is what I'm talking about with the classic fit. It's definitely nice and loose on the bottom. It has a great amount of length to it. As far as the bombshell skinny jeans, oh, I love a size 14 on me so much more than the 12. But let me like stuff this under my bra. So you can see like it definitely has a little bit of room in my waist where the 12 like really hug my waist. So like for any type of holiday events or what have you, I know I would be uncomfortable in the 12. So I'm super excited to have the 14. They fit beautifully. I love the way they like hug everything in all the right places and it's comfortable. Like you can move around, you can squat. And actually I feel like this is like the first pair of jeans I've had in a while that doesn't have a lot of distressing on them. So I find that they're really cute. You can always pair it with a little belt. I picked up another cami in a size one because like I told you all, the ones I have now are in zeros and I just, they're just too, too uncomfortable for me. Even to put like a cardigan on top, I can't handle. I did get another pair of jeans because they're bombshell skinnies. Yeah, they're bombshell skinnies and I got them for $30 some dollars. So why would I not? So I picked up another pair. Uh, this is the high rise com comfortably fits shapes, super skinny leg opening. Oh, oh dang. Well, this will probably be really good for boots. Actually, did I get two of the same pair? What did I do? It's like I just passed out and started clicking buttons or something. I have no idea what I've done y'all, but anywho, I really like this color denim as well. And these are in a 14 regular. I screwed up so hard. All right, so this is in a size one classic fit. Oh. Everybody is beautiful. Amen to that. I love this like movie mauve color. I just think that is so flipping pretty. I got a couple more things. These are a staple staple leggings. These are the premium leggings full length. Can you all see? They've got those cutouts and I love them. They have like fishnet on them. 
They are like my favorite, favorite leggings. This red top is really flippin' cute. I mean, I know I need to get a strapless bra for it and everything, but I really like it. And I know this was, I think, one of the clearance items. As far as these leggings go, I told y'all, these are my absolute favorite. I have put t-shirts and then like a cardigan, duster, whatever you want to call it, denim jacket, moto jacket with these and I absolutely love them. I always get so many compliments on them too. Did not realize it had skulls on it. And again, it's a classic fit, size one. It's really cute. I like the pink. I'm not a huge fan of the whole skull thing, but it's not too bold so maybe i'll get away with it i don't know but i love the fabric it's super super soft and hold on we've got one last thing i swear i thought i bought two bras could have sworn i got two bras anyways i got another cami in this beautiful muted purple color and it's got like the nice like strappity strap straps love that i'm back i forgot to show you my boots that i got from belk so these i did everything oh my gosh maybe somebody said in the review that it ran small i always wear a seven and a half to an eight but one of these boots are in a nine not for sure why so this is the first pair now here's the thing with belk that i noticed they flip and change their prices all the time now i use my rakuten when it comes to everything at belk you can get anywhere from like 3%, 6%, 10% and more cash back. If you do want to sign up for Rakuten, I will have a sign up bonus of $30 down below that you'll receive once you make your $30 uh, qualifying purchase or what have you. It's not an affiliate link. It's the referral link that you're going to get that will give you $30, me $30, share your referral link. It goes on and on and on where you can continuously get that $30 referral link. So anyways, these boots came in like brown and I think they came in black as well but I thought this like taupey cream was really cute and really pretty and what I was going to tell you all is this deal that I had was buy one pair get two free I think is what the deal was so I paid $72 for all three of the boot and they've been doing Black Friday deals so I will uh I'll have to try them on and see how they fit as far as that goes but they are by the brand true craft but i thought they were just too cute they were different you know i kind of want to go back and get like the brown ones i need to also clean out my closet okay so the next one i got for some reason i got in a nine so i'm assuming that people were saying that they ran small yeah they don't really look huge to me for a nine um, but they are that like combat boot type of style and as you know i did pick up a really cute pair from shein but they were on the short side so again these were part of that you know buy one get two for free so i still kind of overpaid if i had just waited again for their 19.99 sale they actually have a pair of chelsea boots that i want to get anyways they have the side zipper and that this one is not a side zipper it's like just put it in and lace it up and all of that so it's going to be a little bit of work where this one you can just slide your foot in oh my gosh Apparently I did buy it in brown. Okay, so I went back to a size eight. I love the like chunky heel. I just love this color so flippin' much. Let me compare these. Oh yeah, that is that's that is a lot bigger than I thought. Okay, anyways, we'll try them on. But how cute are these? And if you can get them for $19.99, I feel like the quality is definitely there. I mean, honestly, even for $29.99, the quality is definitely there. Okay, let me get into trying everything on. I made this video really long. Okay, so I'm not for sure if I got the exact same pair of jeans or not, but I'm kind of starting to think that I did. So the ones that I had on before were the ones that have the super skinny leg opening, and they do. I mean, they are suctioned all the way down. As far as comfort goes, they're definitely comfortable. I do like them. Um, I have the combat boots on in a size 9, and I never buy my shoes in a 9, but I would say 100% they must run small because this fits perfect the shoes and um, I'm never a size nine so definitely make sure I will have them listed and linked down below for y'all 
but uh, yeah definitely make sure to size up I don't think they had half sizes and that must have been why I went or somebody said to do that so anywho the bombshell skinny jeans definitely a favorite pair of my jeans for sure like the favoriteest jeans that I've ever had I would say come from torrid and it's always the bombshell skinnies because they just where you need to be without making you feel like you want to like scream. As far as the top goes, love the top, but it is in a size one classic fit. So it's definitely more of a relaxed fit. That tag is like getting my armpit and freaking me out. And the tag and the waist, I'm like, <sighs> my whole situation. So anyways, I love this. I think it's nice and cute. I went with a regular length and I actually had to cuff them a lot. Let me show you. So I don't know if you can see, woo. That gave me a nice amount of height here. I was thinking I was so tall for a second there. Joke's on you, sis. But if you guys, I don't know if you can tell, but I did cuff the bottom. But do you see, they are like a, all the way down. Like all the way down. Like a cigarette pant, I think is what it's called or something. So it definitely tapers all the way down. I wouldn't say it's my favorite style. They are definitely figure flattering. I mean, that's for doggone sure. Okay, there's just something about their t-shirts. They're just so comfortable. So yeah, I should have gotten all of these t-shirts in a zero. I'm well aware, but I just kept it with the skinny jean pants. Wanted to show you all the boots. These boots are in an eight and they fit perfect. So the combat boot definitely, definitely run small, just like the review said. So if you are wanting these, go ahead and size up. If you are wanting the True Craft like hiker boots, go ahead and stick with your actual size because I'm seven and a half to eight and these are fitting perfectly. Really nice, really comfortable. I just think they are so doggone cute. I started to sweat in these pants they smell so flipping bad that I'm like, you know what? I don't want to have to watch because I still think I paid 20 some dollars for these. I'm actually going to return these because I'm worried that I'm not going to be able to get that smell out. Ooh, it's so bad. It's, it's so bad. And I just showered. So I'm like, do I smell like a funky fish? You know what I mean? Like, oh, it's, it's so bad. So anyways, that is all for today's video. We've had pretty much everything was <sighs> like, I screwed up on the shirt sizes. So that was like my own fault. But if we don't look at like the size issue, then it was good. The pleather pants, oh, stinky, stinky. Now I will have everything linked and listed down below for y'all. I will say though, one thing I want to mention with these jeans is when you're getting out of them, do y'all see how narrow these are? You're literally doing like the kind of dance, like hold on to something. That's all I have to say. Make sure to hold on to something. Definitely not my favorite cut or style as far as that goes because I know my other bombshell skinny jeans are not that narrow at the bottom. But these are good, I would say, if you have like a high boot. So something to keep in mind. I don't think I need two pairs though. I don't need two pairs of like the pretty much the same day gone jean. Anyways, friends, everything will be linked and listed down below. Don't forget if you are shopping Belk, B-E-L-K, however you say it, that's the way I say it. Definitely make sure to use your Rakuten. I hope you all enjoyed this video. There's definitely more to come. I have like a whole nothing but shoes haul coming. Pretty excited about that. Anyway, stick around. Join me on our body positivity journey, learning to love the skin we are in. And until next time, friends, I'll catch you in the next video. Kisses from Kentucky. Bye, friends.